Hey folks, so maybe you've got yourself a homebrewed Wii U and a DS, and you always wanted to mix them. Well, thanks to a lovely piece of homebrew on the 3DS side called NTR, you can send your DS's screens out onto the network. So something I've been working on is a little homebrew I call NTR View, and all it does is it runs on the Wii U and receives a stream from the DS, and there you go, just like that, they're hooked up. And so, you know, this is running in real time. We can come over, we can start a game. I was teasing this on Reddit before, and people were wondering, you know, why I never touched the gamepad. Well, that's because I haven't got input hooked up. There are other clients for NTR that do have input working, so I'm sure it's possible. It's just, for now, it's only video streaming, and it's quite primitive at that, um, as we'll demonstrate a bit later. But as you can see, even in a game, it's working pretty reasonably. We can object to something. Top screen only. Um, it does send the frames for the bottom screen. I just haven't written up the code to display them. We can try something that moves a bit more. This is a homebrew demo from 2018. And it'll show that, you know, this isn't perfect yet, there are some colour issues here, but with all the commercial games I've tried, it's worked flawlessly, at least in terms of colour reproduction. It's just in this that I've had issues. But uh, you can see how that works. A bit later on, it starts moving more, and you'll be able to see it in movement. You can also look at my video of it running Pokemon Ultramoon. There is some weird incompatibilities with Ultramoon on the NTR side, not on the Wii U side. Um, you can read about them on the wiki, so, you know, have to get that fixed at some point. Thanks to the folks in the Pretendo Discord for giving me this idea. Um, I thought it would be really cool, <laughs> and yeah, it's been a lot of fun to work on. Yeah, you can see here the scrolling text is a bit stuttery as opposed to on the console itself. But, you know, that's what you expect um, from NTR. It depends on how your Wi-Fi is doing as well. I've gotten better results when no one else is home and the, these devices can hog the connection for themselves. But it is pretty uh, pretty usable. I played the first case of Dual Destinies, Phoenix Wright Dual Destinies, on this, on the TV behind me. So definitely, uh, definitely workable. So yeah. I'm going to be putting this out as a first sort of alpha, just so you all can have a fiddle with it. It's far from complete. There's a lot of visual flashes and glitches on the Wii U end. You've probably seen a few already. Um, that's just because of a few trade-offs I've made that, in theory, they can be smoothed out. And, yeah, the frame rate's not amazing, but it does work. So, yeah, check it out. I'll um, post the code and, you know, obviously keep working on it, but this is just a release of an early version, I suppose. Enjoy. <laughs> 